Okay, we got the Raven with the repaired axle out. We're gonna see if my welding will hold. Maybe it'll break today. Skis are on. Those are off a of Beaver RX 550. Not a bad ski. They work okay. One thing I don't like about these skis, they're kind of chintzy up in here. You can see where this one's got a kink in there. We replaced this when we put a new piece in here. Oh, I don't know, four or five years ago. But when you move that gear there, when it gets the side low, side to side, a lot of twisting going on there. This old Raven, they were only built with a thinner wall tube, like an 030 or an 035. Later kit Fox is 049 or heavier landing gear. Something might fold up today, I don't know. That's my dis personal disclaimer. Might break, anyway. You wanna fire it up? Yep. This Raven has been out for two weeks since we got snow. Mm. Oh, two, three. three, that should be good. You wanna give it a pull start to try? Give it a pull. Yep, mags are on. This is a pull, a pull start, good old Rotax pull starter. Ah, better get on. I spun over a few times first there to loosen up the oil in the gearbox. Give her another primer. Mags are on, right? Yep. There, try that. Ah, there you go. Prime it. That's why you need a little bit more prime it. Nothing wrong with those Rotax motors. Two weeks, minus ten. Not a problem. 503 Rotax. Got to learn how to keep the prime going. Derek's just new to this airplane. He's got a Beaver with a 582. He's all electric star, big battery, cool radiator, oh, yeah. cool sunglasses, all the cool stuff. There you go. Don't sound like a light combing, but you perform it a lot better in the short time. There we go. Good old ethanol gas. There's all you naysayers. Ethanol gas sucks. Oh, there you go. Ethanol gas. That gas is great. Probably from back in September. Oh, I guess that's ethanol gas is going to die. Maybe not. Anyway, you're gonna get this thing going. I'll get my sled going, we're gonna go follow him around. You have to warm up for the a little bit of crap there, get it moving. Yeah, let her go there. The Ripper! Those skis, they got a UHMW bottom, they'll probably slide right over there. Take your rudders! There he goes. Take your rudders, big boy. There we go. Yeah, fresh snow. Woo, she looks nice. Let's hopefully all those landing gears hold out right. Yeah, look at that. They'll probably go dance around. Yeah, you can go across the field. The runways don't matter anymore. <laughs> They're all two and a half feet under the snow. There, he's going to come back in here now. Look at that. Boy, that kid box looks good. Raven! Those skis, they just float right up on top of that snow pretty darn good, eh? We got about two feet here, but you know what? There's a, underneath that, there's about a, we had so much snow there last weekend. Oh, here comes the snow right at me. We had so much snow, there's a bit of a crust down there, but let's walk out and see how, how much there really is. We had 18 inches of fresh snow today, you know, see there. I'm walking that right now. See, I, I'm on top of the crust. So you can see it's about that deep right there. About a foot deep, and then you punch through the crust. See, so what we got there. there that's, that's how deep the fresh snow is on top, and then there's a crust that keeps going down below there. But that snow, geez, that plane will just sit right up on top of there like nothing. Look at that, it looks good. Ha, ha, ha. He wants to take my head off, it looks like. Yay! Let her rip! Woo! Bloody well, take a prison out here! Hey, he's not having much problem keeping that thing straight now, is he? Nah. Let's get back over here and have a gander. There we go. Rotex 503 on ethanol gas, three or four months old. Seems to be working pretty darn good, really. Oh, it's getting light on the skis there. Yeah, it's gonna go up. See, with a snow like this, even though the skis are slippery, when you get soft snow, it'll slow down quick. You know, I don't like coming in landing here. This is only 500 feet from the hangar out to here. I do her on wheels. 
on skis is not a problem. You come in there, you touch down <laughs> right where he, well, right where he is there now, and Frazier stopped by here in about 200 feet. A couple guys over here. There's a nice Kit Fox over there for sale. Maybe Kit Fox Four. I'm oh, sorry, Kit Fox Two. That one with a 582, brand new, beautiful plane. We never got her over in the other hangar there yet. We might get her over there yet. I think these guys should all buy skis for me, and then guess what? We'll ski flying because it's still good. Here comes Derek. I think I'll bet you he lifts off here. He looks like he's just primed and ready to go. That thing sounds good. Look at that. Oh, she's getting light. Oh yeah, she's up. <laughs> yeah. See, it slows right down there, eh? And he'll just crank that thing around. Crank around there, Derek. I think this means it's time to go back to a different runway back here. Throwing the snow, beautiful. Yeah, that means he's going back to the runway back there. Good old player to go.